All right, we are back for another War of Rights for the last one for this weekend, and it is a War of Secession to close us out here. And we've got uh, two battles tonight. First battle is going to be a Garland Stand, 270 on the server pop, 135 on the defending CSA versus 134 on the attacking Union. So balance looks nice and good. Um, now on the big board, again, uh, you can check out the War of Secession um, playlist to see the uh, metagame. Uh, for the Peninsula campaign, both of these battles tonight are actually in the same same location in uh, location in Surrey County, uh, which is on the right bank bank. Lord, I'm having trouble already. Right the bank of the uh, James River or the south side of it. So, and this first battle is between um, the Eighth Alabama attacking the Ninth Corps. Uh, so, and now it's side swap, so the CSA in-game will be the Union on the campaign board and vice versa, but I'll just, as my usual, um, just refer to them as their in-game sides. We're live at 43, um, so I probably won't have time to do a full look here, but go down each side. So, for the CSA, we have Wilkes here leading the HL, Hampton's Legion. Then we have Knights leading the 8th PA, Johnson leading the 1st VA. See, then we also have 4th Georgia as well under Lieutenant Sauce. And we've got 8th Alabama, who is the uh, leader here for this um, token piece under Ryder. Then we have Disco from the RB. Then we have JD led by Remix, MB led by Metal. And I believe that is everyone. On the uh, CSA team, we've got Coco leading the 20th New York, 9th Corps led by Prudish. Then we've got HD led by Hazard and Dixie. We have IB led by Will, 32nd Ohio led by King Bob. The 2nd US led by uh, Mr. Rally Trooper. We have 79th led by Ricks. The 4th uh, US or the 83rd led by Cat. The SR led by Bikini. Let's see, I think that's all of them. Did I do 32nd Ohio? We got 32nd Ohio here. Looks like we have them under Corporal White. And we have EB under Hazard. And PB under Legion. And we got a decent amount of arty here as well for the CSA. We've got um, Bra from the HD. As well as 9th Corps under Captain Shark here. Some arty. And uh, here we go. Got through the intros. Uh, point of contention is right here. CSA spawn is back over there. Union spawn is back over there. And yep, let me swing in here because we already got the fighting going on. So let's check. See 20th New York, Coco kind of being a little tripwire force here. Making contact with the enemy and then uh, falling back to friendly lines here with 9th Corps. God, I'm having a hard time today. JD moving up. It's so like the Union team is uh, taking up a strong position here on the left side here, but they are happy to do a distance fighting. Well, you see number moving up. One rank, one rank, Ian Thurman. Gentlemen, boys, 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 get in, get in. Volley at the first part, y'all were in a... Oh. That's you. Recover. Recover. Gentlemen, take it out. Northwest. Independent fire. Hey, independent fire. Spread, spread out your fire. Spread, spread out your fire. Game. Spread out your fire. Steady. Remember your trainer. No. Yeah, King Bob possibly looking for a flank and maneuver out here. Right now, it looks like the Union is happy to uh, do some distance firing. As the CSA looks like they uh, have gotten that fort built here with the cannons and the caissons. Let's see, here's 30 second trying that flank maneuver. Pull it back. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Not lingering too long though. 30 second, let's go. Right here. Around 
Now, so far, the uh, Union hasn't done too much damage as far as morale goes. Uh, we'll see if anything changes. Looks like Ninth Corps is going to try for a change of angle. Quick volley and fall back. Uh, and got caught out. Not too bad. Sniper, I guess it's Sniper, he's not uh, Rally leading the second U.S. I think I misspoke on that one. Archer, Archer, to, your Archer to your left. Hi, Archer. Alright. We can shoot from here. You guys They're see right him? Right there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Gentlemen, uh, Looks like IB, Will is going to move his men off a little bit here. Put a little bit more support in the center. Off of these rocks. So you say starting to open up a bit of a ticket lead on the Union. Oh, looks like the CSA has moved up quite significantly over here. EB forming up along with PB a new defensive line along this fence here and has done some heavy damage to the 8th Alabama these other units over here doing some kind of forcing the uh, Union back I think that's what caused much of the ticket damage I saw see Hazard he's going to do an adventure a little advanced but he uh, wisely leaves his flag back with the friendly units good decision there by Mr. Hazard a good TTP that others should adopt in my opinion maybe they're going to do a risky maneuver oh but Union is maneuvering he doesn't have too much time Company, independent fire independent fire independent fire fire I wouldn't stay there this could be, there we go. Good job by that uh, quartermaster sergeant trying to get out of there. We'll see if it was in time. HL. Is he going to charge after him? Start. Hold this fence. Hold the 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 fence. Hold but EB did take some some damage there, but not too bad. It was a it was a risk, but um, I, I think it kind of all ended up even. But they, now you have drawn a lot of Union attention out here. Here's the JD coming out. It might add a new um, direction for this attack. We'll see. Shifting left. Shoot that flag, boys. Hold load. Hold load. Hold load. Hold fire. Hold fire. Hold fire. See what Ryder's thinking here. Ready, boys. TSA's taking a bit of time here. Sorry, Union's taking a bit of time here. CSA is doing fine. And you see here, 9th Corps and 20th have moved up quite a bit. Here they come. Brace, brace, brace. Shifting right, right, east, east, east. Right. Who is this maneuvering? Here's 8th Alabama. Trying to get on to the flank. Hold it, we can hold it, we can hold it. Look to your right, we can hold it. There, there's uh, I wouldn't hold it. We can hold it, Brutus, we can hold it. I wouldn't I'm hold right, it. Right, you right, you right, could, right, but what are you going to lose doing it? And what do you gain from holding it? It's not whether you can hold it, but should you hold it? Knock him down, east, south, east, knock him down. Then we've got another unit has moved up here for the Union. RB's moved up. Alright, I go up now, I go up now. Alright, 
man, hold fire, boys. Hold fire. I'm stuck on screen missing. We have four people coming in, but. Keep those barrels hot! Keep those barrels hot! Fuck it! Shoot them right beside the tree. Open cover. The hard cover wasn't fucking. They got one. Hey, you see a tree? Yeah, but no, a tree can be your friend. Hey, I see a tree. It's being taken right now. That's fine, you're at spawn. When you come back here, I will come back. What are we doing? I am not gonna run back to spawn. Hey, Pennsylvania, disengage to the rear. Spread out. Oh. Wait, we got a team attack on this other side here. I didn't even see this going down. Oh, wait, we got a team attack on this other side here. I didn't even see this going down. Oh, wait, we got a team attack on this other side here. I didn't even see this going down. And Union has done a major attack over here. Hello, fellas. Do you have a moment to talk about? They're coming down the road, left. Oh, shit. Keep on right, keep on right. Now we've got a major counterattack by the CSA over this direction. Don't chase, don't chase, don't chase. Don't chase, Hampton. Do not chase, Hampton. That's going to eat away a lot of that ticket advantage. I'd grab the flag. CSA is starting to lose it a little bit. Oh, my fault, dude. I'm so sorry. Oh, one more. There goes that unit for the Union. Still have one point over here, though. Get that flag up. Good job. Good flag Already got it. As well. Good job, Walker. So you say starting to move back now here. Still got this kind of advanced element here from 20, which, you know... You can have a tripwire out there, that's not bad. I just wouldn't go toe to toe with the line. That's the defender. Not not when you're dead even. That's the luck, Red Bull. Now we do have a bit of a flanking force out here. Possibly. It looks like Legion might be attempting a maneuver. He doesn't have too many men, but he might be able to come in from a good angle and finish off this element here. Mostly left HL. Left face, left face, left face, up and up. Uh, CSA has a bit of an advantage. They got a nine man advantage right now, but it's not, uh, nine's not too bad. It's still, uh, certainly playable. And you see, EB getting in some good shots on their way out. We got a uh, Confederate regiment pushing us from north. north Union north. should be able to push this side now. CSA has really emptied this out here. And in fact, you see Knight has come up to yeah, 20th assault position. Like 20th to 20th fall back, it looks like they did. Which is wise. We're moving north, second US. Moving north. Hold hold Ninth Corps moving out. See where Brutus is thinking of going. Oh shit, right in front. East, 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 fire, fire, pull back with the quickness, boys. I mean, the thing about easy shots is usually the other side has easy shots on you, too. It's kind of funny that way. Yeah. Poor HL, though, is getting swamped. And they're going to knock out two flags here. There goes Snapperkins. Get that flag, get that flag, get that flag, get that flag. And the Union goes down to engaged here, just above the 30-minute mark. Although CSA is not, you know, Union made up some ground there on the tickets. They really need to put pressure on this other side now that CSA is so far out here. Um, I'm kind of surprised they're not putting additional pressure on But maybe they're happy to do the shootout and wait for the reinforcements to come in. But then, if that was the case, why bother doing a uh, flank attack over here? What was that purpose? You know. As for the CSA, good reaction. Um, you know, these guys are keeping them busy, and they haven't really lost yet. So, it's working out fairly well for the CSA. They're just going to watch the casualties a bit. They're doing okay, but... Certainly not an insurmountable lead at all. 
shoot for shit. They can't shoot for shit. Loading, stand by. Crouch to reload. Use the stone wall. You can use the stone wall. Wait for them to volley. They're dumb enough to volley. We'll shoot them. See Dixie there trying to bait them into a volley and then rise and do a volley themselves. RB, keep up those shots. Jump the shots. Skirmish line forming uh, northwest. West northwest. RB, form open order on my line. Open order on the line. Oh no shit. Spacing. Yep. Open order. Hey, left side, left side, left side. Oh, yeah, fire in front, boys! Another forward movement by 9th Corps. I don't know about this. This is risky here. I mean, you do have an opportunity before reinforcements come in, but man. Yeah, good counter charge here from 8th Alabama and 8th Pennsylvania. The 88s coming in. And. Now that's opened up. Oh, good awareness here by these guys. No, 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 keep going, keep going. Take the rocks. Take the rocks, Discord. Take the rocks. Keep charging the rocks. Keep charging the rocks. Let's see, and you see Knight there wants to take the rocks. And a great opportunity, great awareness taking advantage of that opportunity. And there we are at engaged, and the Union has a foothold across this road here, this linear danger area. Let's go! That was giving them so much trouble, and they're just flooding unit reinforcements in. God, I can't talk tonight. Flooding reinforcements in. Uh, Jesus fire, Christ. Right. Independent fire, independent fire. I don't know if I need to drink more or less. Oh, they are going all the way right. They're going all the way. And you can see the uh, CSA still has... Oh, wait a second, though. This is a gutsy move here by the EB. Hitting into the rear of HL. A gutsy attack, and I think uh, it'll pay off for them this time. A very aggressive maneuver there by EB, by Mr. Hazard there, that has paid off. Good dividends there. They can't, I wouldn't linger there. I would I would get out of there now. You, you, you won. Don't piss away the advantage you had. But, um, yep, that kind of kept the ticket lead a little bit. Oh, why are you guys hanging? I mean, I, I got it. You want to chase these kind of out of lines, but I mean, I guess you can sit here and farm out of lines for a little bit. I suppose that's true. Get full kits. I'll hold your fire for now. Check. Hold fire, boys. Load and hold. Check. Just be nervous about sitting out here, especially without a flag. Union behind us. All right, forward march. Like a single Rambo. Oh, forward. I don't know about forward. Yeah, you don't want to piss away the advantage you just had. Pennsylvania! Brace on the right! Brace right! Brace right! Brace right! Oh, they did have a flag. I just didn't see it. Oh, they got to throw it away, though. Why are you sending the flag into a charge? What are you doing? Stop it. That's silly. Yeah, that's going to kind of piss away a bit of the advantage they just got from that. Um, although it might open up a bit here. Go in. Ninth Corps is going to try to do an attack here. This is very aggressive here by the CSA. They really can't afford to lose here. With this attack, it's got to work. Or they're going to be in big trouble on the tickets, as you can see how quickly those tickets are plummeting. But if they regain the position, they might say that's enough. But, um... Pennsylvania, give them your fucking crowd, boys. Give them your hand. Give them the red on the rock. Press C, press C. I'm a friendly, I'm a friendly. Press C. You and me, Froggy, we got this. Nice job, boys. All right. So the attack was not successful. And the CSA still has a ticket advantage, but it's starting to get closer. The Union's got time to reform once again here. 25 minutes. We'll see what the next move is. The CSA has a pretty strong force now here. We'll see if they uh, opt just to move now to a defensive posture or if they're going to try these uh, attacks again. Uh, 
Oh, they're there. They're there. They're there. They're there. They are here. Get the, get the flag out. Get the flag out. Oh, oh, oh. Get the flag out. Get the flag out. Run. Bitch. Run. Oh, Brutus. I'm going to kill him. Oh, that's unfortunate for these guys. That's going to be some nice tickets gained. Set of fire. Straight ahead to the north northeast. Let's see what the next move is going to be. Check. 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 Company's ready. Wait, hold on, we're waiting on Ooh, what do you do? Do you keep up the counterattacks, which have been pretty successful, or do you go to a defensive posture? Um, if it was me, I'd keep doing the EB thrusts out here, catching these guys. I just, there was no reason to charge into the back there. That, that was that was not a wise decision, but I'm like, trying to keep doing these little raids and interceptions and catching these out of lines and, you know, maybe catching this unit as they're coming up unsuspecting. Um, I think that could yield good dividends for the CSA, but I, it's going to be very tough to retake this side here. And even if you do, will it be worth the tickets you lo lose doing it? Now, the CSA is starting to regain a bit of the advantage here doing this shootout, so they might prefer using that fort for cover and getting into this uh, mid-range shootout. It is starting to pay dividends for them. Load hole, boys. As far as the Union, they got to figure out. Oh, wait a second. Here we go. We got Disco and Ryder here. In a bit of a fight here against Ninth Corps, who are using a nice bit of the terrain here, as you can see. Coming up here and then falling back in a pretty well covered defensible position down here that's not easily observable so a good location selected by Mr. Brutish there. I think 20 is with him as well so whoever picked the spot good shot. Uh second US a little bit out here. Uh, I'd be careful about this. And you gotta be careful about that. We need to go. I agree with Tutu. The problem with something like this is you're not going to do nearly as much damage as is going to be done to your team with the way the ticket system works. I, I think uh, Wilkes is right. Uh, the Union is doing okay, but they need to make up some time. Moving northeast, J.D., northeast on the star. See J.D. moving up here. Hold here. Right. Right, right. northeast. Run away, run away, run away, run away. And there you see the call to run away. Oh, we did. Oh, yep, here we go again. This time by 20th has joined the EB. I would not charge in, though. That's that's the thing I'd criticize. I'd sit up right here. Maybe that's what Coco's thinking and putting some shots into him. Yep. Yep. Shoot hold, shoot hold, shoot hold. yep. Right here. Very good maneuver here by the 20th. Oh. Uh, EB is charging in. Uh, but they're kind of leading him. Uh, you can see, yep, here we go. So you see this position Coco was in. I think uh, they would have been better served just from... Engaging from this side and, and falling back. Now it's too late. Again, a lot of tickets are getting. I like the idea. I, I just think EB was a little bit too aggressive in the charge. I think they would have been better served sticking where Coco was. And I think that would have worked out a little bit better for them. It's hard to tell, though, because a lot of the guys are behind the rock, so it's not easy to see how many men there were, but. <laughs> You're out of line, bud. Go back. Where you going? What you going for? 
I'm still in skirmishing. Where are you going, buddy? Wait, where are you going? All right, pull off, pull off, pull off, pull off. Oh shit! Oh shit! Big enemy lock. Big enemy lock, bro. All right, went a little bit too far, but yeah, you can see Union has gone to taking losses here at 19:30, but CSA is starting to fall behind a bit as well. See, now you got uh, Night Breeze. Hey, he might be a good unit for doing, uh, you know, getting these out of lines here. I think, uh, you know, he does some hunting in the woods. That might not. You just got to be careful not to get caught. But that might be a good, uh, good mission set for the second U.S. I got one. Well, I turn back I'll let you know when they push up. I'm like a scared chicken. Oh my god, we got CST in here now? Big Sarge? It happens. Yeah, I'm trying to back up us a little bit. Yeah, oh. Big Sarge. I have moving right to left! I yeah, already come back, I'm Mother Goose. Right yeah. I've just been a fucking bullet magnet this whole goddamn round. Tombo, let's do uh, a oh, I'm surprised I, I haven't died yet. Root is trying to get onto the flank here. See if he can do it. Again, this is working very well, I would say, for them. And again, now that we got the uh, shootout going once more, it kind of surprised the 8th Alabama there a little bit. Shift left, boys. Shift left. I'm taking the street. Is he sticking around? Oh, we do have a punch up here, though, by Wilkes. He's trying to take the center. Here comes E being in a counter charge. CSA goes to taking losses. Hold the barricade, boys. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Just hold here, hold here, hold here, hold here. Hold it, 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 hold it. It's a good call. It's, yep, that's much better. Sit there, you got the cover. Brace here, brace here, brace here. Listen to the orders. Come on now, boys. Get behind the barricade. That's, listen to the officer. He's giving you good, good instruction there. Am I happy to see you, 8th Alabama? Because if you charge forward, you would have ran right into these guys. Stop, stop, stop. You say still has a decent ticket advantage, at least half. So the union's gonna have to figure out how to knock him down a little bit more here. Extend the line right. Come on, on the barricades. You know, I, I think the CSA might be worthwhile of getting. You know, I've been kind of criticizing about being aggressive, but. Um, Watch the fence left, fence left, fence left, fence left. Independent They're doing very good with their bucket ball at these mid-range engagements. So if you can keep the Union in these kind of mid-range, I think you'll be in a good position. You just got to watch so they don't take cap on you. You know, as the battle goes on. Everybody needs to withdraw to the southeast. We're surrounded. Uh, you are surrounded indeed, Mr. Knight. That is true. At least on three directions. APA redeploy on hard rocks right here to the south. Redeploy hard cover. See, that's the problem with doing this kind of maneuver here is you don't want to lose these out of line tickets like that. So it's 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 fine to do those kinds of things, but you got to know. When to get out, and it's tough to tell in the woods. You can't really see. You don't have the flags like I do, and the big overhead view as I move the camera around way too fucking much. <sighs> well, the CSA has retaken the strong point over here. Yes, 20th New York Coco's back on these rocks. So they have regained that ground that the Union had fought so hard to take. And we'll have to see. They got 15 minutes remaining, just about, a little bit over that. See if they can figure out a way to uh, win this battle again and switch sides so this CSA is on the uh, Union team as far as the campaign goes and vice versa. Let's see. All right. Let's pick a unit. TV. I haven't watched PB in a bit. Okay. Down to the defilade. I'll protect you. Use my body. Oh, it's not that kind of show. Hey, line. Steady. If oh, you have a shot. Down, Down that line. DB Steady. rotated back out to this side. Fire. Yeah, this is not bad positioning at all from the EB. Is if the union's not going to really contest this from this angle. 
you know, you got to be aware of it. Keep a, you know, keep an eye out on that side. But uh, so long as the union's going to keep funneling in here, absolutely, very good place to put the unit for EB. PB, please bounce over to the union. It has gotten very bad. It is now 158 for the CSA versus 135 on the union. And yes, PB, uh, it got a lot worse. That can is explain a bit of the uh, trouble the Union's been having. Uh, people leave, people come in. That's what happens. Can I shoot that officer? Okay, they know. Can we run? Yeah, fire and fallback. Run away! Discharge and fallback. Discharge and fallback. Oh, yeah, I see. Union shifting over. Union shifting over more. And us two. Ready? Double face. Double face. Double quick. Yeah, it's still a 19-man inbounds. We'll, uh, I haven't seen PB move over yet. What's the range, sir? He's doing... I promise you got to make sure you do a server announcement, not just in chat, because I don't know if they're in your chat or not. Token. Not our fault. All right, get back after you take your shot. The Battle of the Bulge. Ah, oh, that, that one year. You could take that choke in multiple directions. Yeah, there's one of them. Hell yeah. Hello. Get those loads, HT. Get those loads, boys. We got. Yeah, until the balance. Well, now it's balance, balance again. No, we were dead even when we started. I checked. Come on, gentlemen. I don't know what I'm... Favorite battles. Why are you running from us? Why are you running? Run. They're scared of you! Come back, you right. fucking cowards! <laughs> you yell at us! It's Alabama. It's Alabama. And the Pigs of Valleys. And the Pigs of Valleys here. Pigs of Valleys. Off the charge. On the line. Pigs and Valleys, boys. Pigs and Valleys. You got shots fired into them, boys. You got shots fired into them. On post, boys. Got him Stay down, Hampton. Or I meant PA. Don't watch me get this flag. Four boys! I'm your flag bearer, Sledge. It's okay, Irish. Okay, 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 I still love you, baby. Well, I call this shot. It's all them. Hold your shots. shots. It's all them. Hold your shots. I mean, two seat. Oh, no. We're up in the round left. Ten minutes remaining. Union's gonna have to figure out some way to hit. And hit soon. They are not winning this dis distance gunfight. They really are not. We'll see if the imbalance will solve it, but I don't. I don't think it will. At most, it'll make it even. Alright, on the 
Hey, Major, do you mind backing up slightly? You're fucking us in the middle of the field. Up. <laughs> Thank you. Keep shooting, Horton. Horton, do a bomb. Give him hell, you brand of eagles. Please, and then we jump. Lot of fire. Gotta get them breaking. Keep landing, don't Hold fire, hold fire, hold fire. Cease fire, cease fire, cease fire. Hold fire. Stay at the ready, but cease fire. It's like a direct attack on the fort. I don't know about this. We'll see. Get away! Get away! Get away! And the union goes to breaking. Welcome to the wall. Would you like a freaking token for your gratitude for dying for a stupid? Clear! 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 Um, I I think uh, a 15 tariff percent on exports is an appropriate level in order to uh not uh, severely hurt our exports, but to um you know promote our local industry. I mean, why why do we want to give more money to the British? Plug in the hole, suck it. Clubs to go. Clubs, 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 clubs. clubs. Plug in the hole, plug in the hole. Plug in the hole here, boys. Plug it in. Plug it. Plug the hole. Plug the hole. Fuck you. Hold it, hold it, boys. And the CSA is holding, but you can see they've taken a big, good amount of cash as he's doing it, and the Union's still fighting here. So. Ow. Attack is not hey, horrible. There's a, there's a reb in here. Balance Thank you, Ryder. Kill that man. Kill that. Kill that man. Kill them too. They're pulling back. Keep them back. I'll kill that officer. US. Get that flagger. Clear them up. Clear them up. Clean them. Clean these rebels. Clean them. Nathan Alabama. Ryder's gonna pull his men out of there. I think that's wise. He he did what he was gonna do. He's not gonna do too much more. So. No point in wasting time and uh, tickets, so good call, in my opinion, from 8th Alabama. Been out of there. Yeah, it's tough on balancing because people will leave in the middle of an event, and it's it's frustrating because you would think, okay, well, people leaving come, you know, and coming in, it would be about even, but um, it, it never is, and it's always favoring the side that's that's the side that's losing always dumps out more, and it just creates you know a cascading effect. So it's very t it's, there's no way to police it either. Like, oh, I could penalize units. Like, eh, suppose, but you know. It's tough. It's tough, and it's always annoying when you're in the middle of a fight and telling you know telling a unit they got to switch over. So it's not an easy part of the game. You know, you could leave on team balance, um, you know, but then that forces people to play on a side which is not their unit, so people don't like that either. So you know, there's no perfect solution to it for events that I've seen. Just gotta be uh, you know, Semper Gumby, always flexible. Of course, a little bit out here, man. About this British. And you can do a fire and forget, but. I'm moving up now. I'm coming for you, you dirty. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! They come, get it, come. Well, it's gonna work out. He's gonna be behind him now, so. That worked out for British. Stay back. Yep, there's ninth core. So that actually worked out quite well for ninth core. I thought they were a little bit far out, but the uh, 
Union did not really uh, check their flanks before they went in. And Nice Court made them uh, made them hurt for it. And you got the other problem here is you have the Union a bit disaggregated here. They didn't all go in together. Union about to go to final push. Although you can still lose this from the CSA. I don't get too antsy out here. I think they're being a little bit too uh, too forward with this shit, to be honest with you. It's the breaking. Get our flag out. Get our flag out. Get this flag out of here. Oh, shit. Now the CSA still has a pretty good uh, position here. Union really needs to mess up before this next attack. See if they can uh, do it and figure out a uh, good angle of attack. Or multiple angles of attack. Again, that, that fort is tough to take. And by fort, what I'm talking about is, is what they constructed here. You guys see it? This is the fort. It's the final push. The guys were engaging for no reason. Hey, get the fuck back here! Charge of your fucking. God, you guys play like fucking pussies. Again, a very disaggregated charge here from the Union. It likely will not work. And again, you know, the Union had that huge uh, disadvantage on personnel halfway through the map, so, you know. Excuse me, mister, but you spawned in the wrong place. And the CSA is going to charge forward, and uh, I guess they're looking for kills right now. Again, look how disaggregated this Union Force is, though. So. But yeah, nothing wrong with the CSA doing a forward defense here for the uh, last couple minutes. Get a. Uh, Nope, they're still going forward. Yeah, you can get some extra kills on the token. Not a bad idea, you know, keep them forward. Pretty much got the map one. Uh, it'd be very, uh, I don't see how the unique could pull this out now. It's, 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 it's been done for a minute. So on the big board, this will be a Union victory, uh, the first victory on the uh, south bank of the James. And this will be Ninth Corps winning a defensive battle, of all things. This um, probably wasn't here tonight, that's why. Um, not that he would have lost, it was he, he would have made them attack even if they were on the defense. But the, um, yeah, what was my thought? Yeah, so... Um, We'll see how the next battle goes, but um, this could open up that uh, southern flank quite significantly and uh, creates a bit of a dilemma here for the uh, CSA in the Grand Campaign side. But we'll see. We will see. But yep, good way to get some extra kills here. It might matter down the line. And there we go. So, yep, one more map to go. Tough loss there for the uh, CSA campaign. 
Um, good, good victory here for the USA campaign, CSA in game. So, um, Garland's is a, a tough attack map, but um, you know it's it's certainly winnable. Twenty under is is tough, you know. But yeah, we started even. Got one more battle to go. If the 83rd can pull out a victory here uh, on a very tough map, um, so <laughs> that would be a, uh, a big win. But we will see. And you can see a lot of casualties were inflicted on, the, uh, on that token as well. From 930 to 1596, that is a, uh, that's a tough one.